now, once more, I find myself at a crossroads in my life. Successful entrepreneur, outrageously wealthy, rubbing shoulders with all the right people in all the right places. So where does one go to from here? What to sink one's not inconsiderable teeth into now? Why, politics, of course. Politics! The last refuge of scoundrels and enterprising entrepreneurs like myself. It's a natural progression for one of my talents. And there is a precedent for this, of course. Caligula, Emperor of Rome, had his equine advisor in Cytatus made into a senator. But I want to go one way. I want to be Prime Minister. And I will stop at nothing to achieve it. I have a bit between my teeth. I will jump all hurdles put in my way. Wild horses will not drag me from my goal of being the first Equine Prime Minister anywhere in the world! <laughs> and I have the wherewithal to lobby support from across the political spectrum. Of course I would have to pony up certain uh, suitable incentives to garner such support. No, 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 no. Certainly not right. How dare you? I drive him at the very suggestion. I like to think of them as gifts. And as we all know, no politician can look a gift horse in the mouth. <laughs> so this evening, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to take this opportunity to launch the one thoroughbred Equine First Party. Yeah. <laughs> 